So I'm starving. I need to eat something like right now before I completely lose it. I'm gonna make peanut butter toast with banana on top. It's super yummy, a lot of protein, and most importantly, it takes literally like three minutes. And it's mainly because I have to wait for the bread to toast. <laughs> Down. It's currently 11.30 p.m. right now. I'm whispering because my bathroom is literally right across my dad's room. I did laser hair removal last year. There still is a little bit of growth, so I'm gonna epilate whatever's left under my arms. It's been a while since I used her. My nails have seen better days. I think I honestly have converted to press-on nails. The pack of 30 press-on nails, it has So it has like the full kit and this one was $9.99. So if you think about it, like for me, whenever I go to the nail salon, I always do extensions and some type of design, which, you know, that kind of adds up over time. So I get bored of my nails pretty quickly too. I think I'm gonna go for this one because it's just so cute. It's like pink, it has hearts and little gems on them. The nail glue I'm going to be using today is the Beauty Secrets Nail Glue. My previous set of press-ons, it lasted me like two plus weeks. So they're doing something right here. seconds but damn that's kind of long so I'm just holding it for maybe like 15 20 <laughs> Zoe here. I really was gaslighting the heck out of myself into thinking that my hair looked good. <laughs> I think it's because I sat in that chair for like three plus hours. I paid over $300 for the whole service. My hair is severely damaged, frizzy, dry. There's no soft curls like I asked for. It's just kind of wavy mess if that makes any sense <laughs> for those of you who don't know like i didn't know you are not supposed to do any type of digital perm with bleached hair i bleached my hair multiple times from 2021 to 2022 dyed my hair black last year i disclosed all this information to my hairstylist not once did she tell me it would severely damage my hair and that she does not recommend it you're basically frying your hair and also my hair color did change 
much. I don't know much about hair. I was trusting a hair professional. It's one thing if I was informed and educated as a customer that, you know, getting a digital perm with my given hair history would be very bad and it would change the color, X, Y, Z. And if I still wanted it, knowing that, then that's a different story. Honestly, it's not the end of the world. It's just hair. But yeah, just wanted to preface and throw this little note in. Back to the video. Now I have just like naturally soft waves. I'm gonna go to this local Japanese supermarket. I wanna check out some of the Japanese skincare and hair care items there. Let's go. get another i think it's a helix piercing how far away is it first of all <sighs> am i really gonna get a piercing right now let me give them a call yeah all the piercings are on a walk-in basis only okay sure thank you so i think i'm just gonna go and we'll see if we get a piercing or not Finished up my piercing appointment. I was gonna get a helix piercing, but I decided to get a conch piercing. She's a little irritated right now, but yeah, very happy. I was so tempted to just get like three more piercings because the pain was honestly not that bad. But for now, I think the conch is good. from the vet. The vet examined Boo and she said his heart and lungs are all good. Basically, she thinks it's like more environmental behavioral. She told me to just basically monitor him more and do like a behavioral and environmental check. So there could be a lot of different factors that are making him be like that. But at least right now, he seems to be okay and just have to keep monitoring and checking in. Got some flowers from a special someone. I am totally kidding. It's for my dad. <laughs> all the fur clumped up from brushing him for like 10 minutes. have a nice little day with my dad. It's his day off, so she wanted to go to the mall. And yeah, we're just gonna have a little father-daughter date today. <laughs> 20 years, you're a baby. Really? You're like 20 years. 